Iowa has over 10,000 factory farms, known to the industry as CAFOs, or Concentrated Animal Feeding Operations. These are not your mom and pop family farms that sell at your local farmer's market. Instead, these are industrial animal production operations owned by corporations that pollute like a factory. Picture animals being held at high densities in indoor stalls until they are transported to processing plants for slaughter. In Iowa, there are eight pigs for every one person, over 26 million corporate-owned hogs in total. Those factory-farmed pigs produce 22 billion gallons of untreated toxic liquid manure every single year. That's the equivalent of over 45 million people. That untreated manure is stored in pits or manure lagoons, basically a pool of manure, until it is dumped onto fields all across Iowa. But there's a problem. The soil becomes too saturated, almost three times what it can hold. It can't soak in all of the nutrients from those billions of gallons of manure, so the excess becomes a dangerous and toxic waste product. That excess contains nitrogen, phosphorus, pathogens, and heavy metals, and enters our surface water systems through agricultural stormwater runoff, soil erosion, and tile drains. The excess nitrogen is toxic to us and causes blue baby syndrome, higher rates of cancer, and requires expensive treatment to be cleaned out of drinking water. The excess phosphorus is also toxic to us and contributes to the creation of blue-green algae in lakes and rivers and also cyanobacteria, which can be dangerous when people or animals consume or come into contact with it directly. It can cause skin rashes, infections, and even kill pets. Cyanobacteria thrives in lake water and slow-moving water during the warmer months of the year. Climate change increases both air and water temperatures and in turn increases the severity of cyanobacteria proliferation and its impacts to water quality. Industrial agriculture and factory farming is the number one contributor to water pollution in streams and rivers. You might be surprised to learn this. Many people think that our water pollution comes from other sources. That's because the factory farm industry likes to spread misinformation to protect their profits. They say that our water pollution comes from everything from golf courses to flocks of geese. But the fact is that Iowa's extreme water pollution comes from industrialized animal production. We have over 700 impaired waterways in Iowa, largely due to runoff from factory farms. This impacts everything and everyone. If you own a well, if you go canoeing or kayak or fish in Iowa's rivers, if you go swimming at a public beach, this affects you. If you turn on the tap to drink water, to bathe or shower, or even to cook, this affects you. And it's not just the people of Iowa. Since Iowa is one of the top contributors of the growing dead zone, it even impacts our far neighbors down in the Gulf of Mexico. And what's worse, we're paying for this out of our own pockets through higher water bills to clean our dirty water and our tax dollars are being used to pay and clean up manure spills. The companies who create this pollution, like Smithfield Farms, Iowa Select, and Tyson are not paying for this themselves. And that's not right. At Iowa CCI, we know that Iowa is not doing enough so we're taking it into our own hands. That's why we sued the state of Iowa, because we need bold solutions to clean up our huge water quality issue.